Brown getting off to an early start as Jake Diamond is hagging billion dollar bills before the bell. And the semi-final matchup is now officially underway. Diamond driving his entire body weight down upon the chest of billion dollar bill. This battle of the big men might end early right here, but no. The winner of this matchup will go on to the final of this tournament to determine a new number one contender. And remember, both of these men have already wrestled one matchup before tonight. Jay Diamond was able to defeat Charade to advance to the semifinals, while Billion Dollar Bales defeated the braggadocious Airman Banks. So both of these men having very physical matches early in the tournament against men that were smaller than them and now having to switch gears and face off against power versus power. The battle of the big men right here in the semifinals, Billion Dollar Bale and Jake Diamond. Of course, Billion Dollar Bale, one half of the tag team champions. His partner Nick Halen also advancing and later on Nick Halen will take on the Butcher in the other semifinal matchup. So if Billion Dollar Bales and Nick Halen are both successful, the finals of this tournament will be between the tag team champions. But not if Jake Diamond has anything to say about it here, grinding down on the arm of Billion Dollar Bales. Bales with his foot on the bottom rope, that's going to call for a break. And Jake Diamond will have to dig out something else in his repertoire to put away Billion Dollar Bales. Now we talked about Bales being one half of the tag team champions. Should be noted that Jake Diamond has never tasted championship gold in the AWA. And that might be a very deciding factor. That might make Jake Diamond just a little bit more hungry as he grazes him across the face with that clothesline. Right across the bridge of the nose. Diamond's power definitely evident as he drove down billion dollar bales with relative ease. And now it seems he might be going for another clothesline to put the nail in the coffin of billion dollar bales, but no. Bales ducking that clothesline and bringing down Diamond. Bales leveling Diamond. Diamond now prone on the canvas. Here comes billion dollar bales off the ropes and drives the elbow down across the chest. He hooks the leg, there's the cover. Didn't have enough weight on those shoulders to keep Diamond down for a three count. A mistake that he may pay for later on. Senton all the way down across the chest. He goes for the cover once again, but no. Once again, Diamond able to kick out. Well, Diamond still down from that previous offense. By Billion Dollar Bale. Bale's now going for a front chancery, a front face lock. A maneuver made famous in the Northeast by Bruno Sammartino. Bales now couldn't get a submission, bringing Diamond up to the corner and delivered a European uppercut. And another European uppercut right across the chest, right underneath the chin. And a third one. Oh, and that one may have brought Jake Diamond. Inverted atomic drop. Diamond still on his feet, but I'm not sure how. He comes in and gets nailed with a spine buster. Oh, Billion Dollar Bales is moments away from advancing to the final round of this tournament. Diamond now down in the corner. Referee now checking on him. Diamond making a very big deal about his ankle. Wait a minute. Here comes Eric May. Oh, look out. Oh, vicious kick there by Eric May behind the referee's back. Diamond was distracting the official. The official didn't see any of it. Billion Dollar Bales was just laid out by that roundhouse kick. DDT there by Jake Diamond. Spikes him down head first. There's the cover. And it's over. Jake Diamond and the gym class heroes steal this one like a thief in the night. And now Diamond goes on to the final round in the finals of this tournament.